Today, Wolves completed the signing of Ireland winger Stephen Hunt from Hull. The 28-year-old has put pen to paper on a three-year contract after joining for an undisclosed fee. Stephen, congratulations and, and welcome to Wolves. What are your thoughts about the move finally going through? Yeah, uh, obviously it's been a long time coming in terms of speculation and stuff, so I'm glad to get it done now and, and uh, looking forward to the season. I think Mick McCarthy, when he said himself, he's tried to sign you a lot. There's been a lot of speculation. Obviously, January, the bid went in, which was made public. I mean, is that a, shows you how much Mick really thinks of you and how much he's been so keen to bring you in, doesn't it? Yeah, I suppose. Uh, it was out of my control in January what happened, and uh, I'm thankful now it's done, and I'm looking forward to the new season. But I uh, say thanks to Hull as well for being so understanding with my deal, and uh, wish them all the best. I was to say, there's some mixed feelings because you did have a good year, you know, up until the injury at Hull, scored a few goals, and. Yeah. Play of the season as well, I think, weren't you? So yeah, I done okay. Uh, I was I was scoring a few goals and I had a, a good amount to tell you until February. So uh, at six, so hopefully I can I can beat that this year with a few more after as well. So see how we go. How impressed have you been with Mick in talking to him? I mean, he's, he's obviously a big name in Ireland and he he tends to develop players as well. You looking forward yeah. to working with him. Yeah, looking forward to to working with with the manager and and the players. I know a lot of the players, so uh, there's a good bit of banter flies around the place and. Uh, Looking forward to being part of that and, and having a good season and, and, and working hard, which is the most important thing. You've got a fair bit of Premier League experience yourself. I mean, Wolves are in a position now where they've had one year of surviving and trying to sort of just push on that little bit. I mean, you know, what can you bring to the table in yeah. terms of hopefully helping them out? I suppose a little bit. I've done too much talking last year regarding the second season and that kind of stuff, and it's important. But at the same time, uh, I'm not going to mention. I'm just going to get my head down, work hard, and, and hopefully let our talent uh, get us up the table in the Premier League, which is the most important thing. Do you think sometimes, as you say, Hull were into the second season, the same thing happened at Reading. Do you think you can sometimes think about it too much instead of just concentrating on Yeah, I think, I think a lot was made of a second mm. season a couple of years ago, but now the most important thing is now is just work hard and keep the same hunger and desire to, to do well. And if the team can do that, then we'll, we'll be OK. I, mean, I think you've, uh, you've done some damage against Wolves down the years with a few assists and goals and uh, some great fans here. I guess now it's, I mean, the fans are delighted that you've signed. You're now looking to play for them and hopefully in the atmosphere at Molyneux and, and beyond. Yeah, obviously all I can do is do my best and, and go out every week and, and, and try and set up goals and try and score goals and do well for the team, which is the most important thing. And uh, looking forward to it because I've, I've got to miss the last two or three months of the season just gone and I was really enjoying my football there, to be fair. And uh, I wish them all the best, but I'm now it's a fresh challenge for me and I'm looking forward to it. You mentioned you know a lot of the lads. I mean, in particular, yeah. obviously, Kevin Doyle, Marcus Hanneman, you've played with before. Looking forward to... Linking up with them again? Yeah, obviously. I uh, know Doyle very well and know Marcus very well, so both of them are, are good people and I uh, look forward to playing them. But I also know a few of the other boys as well and, and you get to know the character of the other players as well from playing against them. So it uh, should be fun and can't wait to get started. And just finally, the injury, how are things? I think that hoping for sort of late October time, is that the uh, current <laughs> estimate, if you like? Or? <laughs> if it's late October, then I'll hang my boots and I think I'll be. I think I'll be retired because I've had enough, but nah, it won't be. It'll be hopefully be a little bit earlier than that, and uh, obviously I'll follow the instructions of the physio and and keep it so I get it right, and then I'll be back for the rest of the season. Then, like so, uh, sometimes it's better to to play to finish the season well than like what I did last year. It's, it's awkward when you don't finish the season, you you feel like you you haven't achieved much. So this year is important. I get fit and then stay fit for the rest of the year.